Hey guys, so sometimes I do get mad and it's fine, I will get over it, but it's something we need to talk about. And it's something that I see online right now and I just get super confused. Uh, so there it is, I see some hate on Samsung right now, on Samsung's new devices, the uh, Galaxy A series for 2016. I only have picked up the Galaxy A5 here, the new edition, I have both colors here both the black and the golden edition. So what I'm seeing online in reviews is people people seriously calling this device for laggy and having bad performance. And I'm like, oh no, no, what are you talking about? Because that's not my experience. Uh, I do know there's two devices uh, of this A5 out, one with Snapdragon 615 and one with like, I think it was Exynos 7580. And I have like a 75 and 80 or, or something, I'm pretty sure, because I have the Mali GPU. And I'm like, what are they talking about? Because they're saying, okay, they were talking about that both devices uh, online on videos, that both devices, both the Snapdragon 615 and the Exynos one was slow. And I'm like, these devices, bro, these devices are not slow. I bought two of them here and I don't see no lag. Like, this device is also a mid-range device. Let's compare it. Let, mm, what happened when Sony released their Sony Xperia Z5? Well, it was a high-end device for like 700 euro, and that phone kind of lagged. But Samsung's phones here even perform better. Like, I don't see no lag. Like, where's the lag? Like, I see, I see they like bash Samsung. They be like, oh, when you open it up, it's laggy. No, do you see lag? No, there's no lag here. Like, it's running good. It's running really good. And the other thing was, they were talking about, uh, oh, Samsung, we don't have these with six, uh, Android, the latest 6.0 beta, uh, or the latest Android 6.0. And they were bashing Samsung for not releasing these devices with a new version of Android that almost no device have at the moment. Like, not even Samsung's high-end phones have gotten the Android 6.0 update at the moment. Okay, they have released it in South Korea at the moment in like one region, but you, you must be crazy if you think that if when, when, when there's almost no device out with 6.0 right now, it's only like Nexus devices and like one or two more perhaps, that, 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 that Samsung would instantly now have it in their mid-range devices. Of course, it's not gonna happen that fast. I mean, I, I just get I, I get pissed off because it's like, you know, of course they're not gonna have 6.0 already. There's almost no device out which has Android 6.0 installed. Uh, it's like, please, please. Samsung hasn't even released it on their high-end phones, and there's almost no other phone out there with 6.0 at the moment. So of course, Samsung's mo mid-range phones are not gonna have it. And then I see this thing where they bash touch with. Oh, TouchWiz is slow, TouchWiz is this, TouchWiz is that. Like, this TouchWiz is Samsung's uh, UI on top of Android. And people say it's ugly. I don't know what you're talking about, man. I think it's really, really, really good looking and it, that it runs really, really nice. Like, what is wrong with this? Like, I think this look is amazing. Like, personally, it looks amazing. Even the multitasking looks extremely nice. And it's good speed, man. It's good speed. Uh, so what are you, what are they talking about? This device is amazing and it costs like 400 euro or something. I mean, it's a good price. And I, not just that, but the device feels extremely premium. It feels like a high-end phone for twice the price. Yes. And even the camera is fast. Look at this. Let's see. Oh, let's see. I'm going to double tap. Yeah, look at this stuff, man. Look at this stuff. I'm gonna close the camera. So look at this stuff, man. That's good speed. It's already up and running. And you can be like, like, is this bad speed? No. TouchWiz is amazing on these devices. And they're probably gonna get, hopefully, the 6.0 update when it's gonna come out. But, and not just that, but I, they also have drop tested this device. It did survive. I did Coca Cola test. It did survive. I did a knife test. It did survive. I did a water test also in three minutes with an iPhone, and it did survive. Like this is like a super phone, and that you get all of this 
even a fingerprint sensor. I mean, what, you get everything with this phone. I mean, this is really, really a good price phone. So I don't know what people are talking about. And I should remember you guys that maybe the Snapdragon 615 phone has major issues, but I'm pretty sure this is the Exynos 7580 device in Europe that I got. Uh, and uh, like, there is nothing wrong with it. <laughs> I mean, seriously, there's nothing wrong with it. Uh, and uh, when I did this Geekbench test, it's like it got twice the score of the earlier generation phone from one year ago. Samsung has doubled the speed in a year. I mean, that's amazing. Like, you get so much, man. It's so crazy how many good things they've done. It's even an HD display on the phone. Like, how can you bash this phone, man? Like, how can you bash it? It's amazing. Like, it, it truly is amazing. And I'm really, really shocked how nice it is. Um, but, I mean, I really enjoy the first one and that they're like making it better. Like, they make it really, really good. This is a really, really good phone. Uh, and that you also have like, you have these themes and stuff like that that you do get on a high-end Sammy phone. So, good job, Samsung. This is a really good phone. Yeah. So, this is my opinion. Uh, I don't want this device to be falsely accused of being a bad phone because it seriously isn't. Like, I even played games, high-end games, GTA, uh, with the Malay variant here, and it ran, ran amazing. I mean, I have a video on it. I even played it on high graphics. It ran great. So, what are people saying, man? Are they saying it's a bad phone? Like, wow. Wow, what more do you want? It even has an SD card or like you can insert like extra storage. Like it's so crazy how many good things in, is in this phone. Uh, yeah, Samsung, good job. Good job. Release more amazing phones. <laughs> so yeah, that's just my opinion on it. Now you have heard it. Now I feel better. Now we can get back to the normal videos. <laughs> Hopefully enjoyed and uh, peace.